Hello, today on the channel we're going to be unboxing Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta. Part of the Dragon Star series figures from Bandai. This is Dragon Ball Super figure. There's the front of the box. Let's flip it on around and check out the back. Full back picture right there. It, this box is kind of warped on the bottom, so it likes to rock forward. I don't know if I can get it to stand. Oh, please stand. It's just got this like rounded on the bottom. I don't understand how it was sitting that way, but I can't get it to sit this way. Let's put a little stick them down. That'll get it to stand. There, it's not great, but at least you can see the back without it falling over. <laughs> and then let's see if we can get the side without it falling over. It's probably gonna be, yeah, it's gonna be the same deal. I gotta put a little stick them down. There, that did the trick. Let's bring the camera back just a tad. Yeah, right there, all right. There's Vegeta, and then we'll go this way. It's Vegeta again, same picture. And then the top is your Dragon Stars logo. This one is not a reflective logo. This is just straight, uh, looks like they added white, really white here, and then they went kind of grayed out to give it that look like it was reflective, but it is no longer reflective. But it still, still does have the black uh, fractures behind it. And the bottom of the box is your a bunch of legalese. There we go. There's a focus. Uh, yeah. All right. Let's set it. I don't know. Here. Bring the camera back even more. Let's get a little closer look real quick to the front of the box and the back. There's a four plus Bandai, Bandai Namco. Uh, warning three plus. There's that Dragon Ball Super logo. And there's Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta. Very cool. A couple of blast hands included that you can change out with his punchy fists. And there's the bottom of that Dragon Star series Vegeta Super Saiyan Blue. That's a cool picture down there. And the backside, you got your Dragon Ball Super logo, Dragon Star's logo, non-reflective on this one. And there's some other uh, figures on the wave. There's Cooler's Final Form and Bardock. And yeah, Goku and, uh, can't think of his name. Goku's dad, anyway. Uh, there's your bottom of the box with your barcode and legalese. Very good. All right. Raditz. <laughs> Goku and Raditz is dead. It just came to me. Bardock. Okay. Let's set... Actually, let's set it right here. Wait, where's the tape on this one? All right. Usually they have two big rounded pieces of tape here. It looks like with this one, they kind of cut some costs because they did away with a lot of the reflectives. And they went with just one little piece of tape on the top. So... That's fine, whatever. If they gotta cut costs and I still got a great figure and they just cut costs on the box, that works. There's the top tape cut, done. Let's put this cap on, no blood, fantastic. And let's get this Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta unboxed. There we go, there we go. All right, they give him kind of a yellow background to contrast that blue, very cool. Take that off. And let's get these hands out first. Blasty hands. And Vegeta. Alrighty. There he is. Very good. Alright. Oh no! But now you can see it's just a ball joint, but it's not going to give you any rock. It's just a side to side ball joint. Oh my gosh, so this one, <laughs> this figure's waist is so loose. Like, don't be pushing too hard or that waist is going to pop off. All right. I just, sorry, I can't stand the pose that he's in. It looks weird. That looks a little better. Anyway, I wanted to kind of put the camera about there. Just show you everything that comes in the box. Just comes with the extra two blasty hands. Then I wanted to show you his other forms. So this is the... Another Dragon Ball Super figure. This is just Vegeta with his non-powered up hair. It is pretty much the exact figure, except... So the yellow looks exactly... As, well, the yellow is a little bit dulled compared to this one. And this one has a darker, more more bluish. This one whoa, has a blue that's more grayish, I would say. But it's weird because his bicep... Bicep. Bicep. Here matches, but this one doesn't. I don't know why. That's weird. And then here is the Super Saiyan version. The yellow. 
right there. So there's three different versions of Vegeta there. They all have different color blue. Um, obviously, yeah, they kind of go on over there. So your lightest blue is with the yellow hair. Your more grayed out blue is with the blue hair. And then your deep dark blue is your standard Vegeta. And they all kind of have different yellow too. So all a little different, but all very cool. All right, let's move these guys out of the way. Let's see here. Let's grab Vegeta, bring him forward, get a focus going, do some articulation. So head up, that's it. Head down. Oh, I broke that waist off again. Yikes. Okay. There's your head down. It's not the best, but it's not the worst. Um, you get a little bit on that neck, but not a ton. And it is on a ball joint, so you're going to be able to go 360. Uh, his his uh, shoulder is a uh, peg going in on a rocker, so you can obviously move the arm 360 and then rock out wherever you need to go. There, on these Vegeta figures, there's just this big gap. It's kind of odd, but if you can keep it pushed up, it looks okay. When it's down, it's weird, and you can see in. Obviously, you can see below, but I feel like under the armpit, you don't see it as bad. So that's how I usually pose these for the videos and stuff. He does have a bicep cut. You can move that 360. Like I said, for some reason, this bicep is a different color than the rest of his, even the other bicep. Okay, whatever. All right, double jointed elbow has one pin. For whatever reason, Vegeta, uh, all the Vegetas just have the one pin. They don't have one up here. Um, yeah, so it'll get you past 90 right there. A little bit past 90. And then the hands are a ball joint on a rocker, and they can be pulled off to switch. And then, of course, we've seen how this is put together. It's a ball joint, but it's not going to give you any hula hoop action, so no forward and back. It is just side to side, 360 around. Then his leg has a ball joint in there, and then there's a little uh, cover over the top of the leg, so that gives you like a thigh cut action right there, so you can get that swivel going. His out cut is right, out cut is out kick is right there. Front kick is pretty good. Back kick. Oh, it was about right there. Double jointed knee. Does have pins on the Dragon Stars figures. Get you to there. And then his foot is just like the hand. It's a ball joint below. And it's got a rocker on top. So you can kind of move that around when you need to. And get that foot position you need to. And it works pretty good. You just have to work with it a little bit to get it where you need it to go. But it will do whatever you need it to do to stand the figure up. Alright, let's set Vegeta here. Again, this is everything that came in the box. So just the two blasty hands. Get those out of the way. Let's throw some other figures next to him for some scale. Here is Super Saiyan Goku. Here is a Super Saiyan 2 Gohan. And let's throw Krillin over there next to him too. Why not? And we've got Piccolo. All right, let's see if we can get them all in frame and in focus. There we go. There's your Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta crew. All right. Stay tuned for some posing. Thanks so much for watching.